So we're here at Woodward of Copper's Airbag. Completing the one-hit wonder is pretty important because again, this is the next step. Once you land a trick in the foam blocks a couple times, it's time to bring it out here to the airbag. So keep in mind, just like in the barn, you need to easy style it out here. You need to inspect the jump before you hit it. Always hit the small side first just to test speed. And you need to start with the straight air. You need to make it over the gap to the bag. Most people land a little bit short, so be sure to follow those three steps. Inspecting the jump, hitting the small side first, and doing a straight air just to make sure you're landing in the sweet spot of the bag. We are here at the drop-in for the Woodward of Copper Airbag. There will always be a coach up here directing you on when the jump is clear and when it's safe to go. When exiting the bag, take a look down there. Make sure you stay in the little corral that we've created for you guys. You don't want to go back out into traffic. There will always be a coach down at the knuckle too, giving the clear sign or the close sign. Just like in the barn, we have to pay attention to all those things. The drop-in is also engineered for the right amount of speed for the jumps. You can really drop in and point it for the big side and the small side. We are here on top of the airbag. Again, when jumping into the bag, you always want to aim for the dead center of the bag. That's the sweet spot. It's where it's at its bounciest. Riding on the surface on the airbag, there's going to be some snow on it. It's slippery. Remember, the airbag is designed to help you if you crash. But remember all those good crashing tactics you learned in the barn. You always want to touch your board or skis down first and then roll out of it. You never want to land right on your belly or right on your head. Remember those good tumbling progressions you learned in the barn. Chin to chest, round your back, keep your arms in for safety, and you can just roll out of those hard tricks. You want to make sure you're riding flat base if you're on a snowboard and flat skis if you're on skis. If you're leaning, much like in the barn, it's going to catch your edge and knock, knock you down. It's kind of like riding on a box where you want to just be real flat on your board, let your board go straight and ride right off of here. On the exit of the bag, again, stay over close to the trees. You don't want to go out into traffic. Remember to have a fun, safe, and progressive day out here on the airbag. Communicate with the coaches. Remember the open and close signs. Ride within your ability level. Remember. Those progressions from the barn, the idea is to bring them out here on snow in a safe and fun manner. So have a great day at the airbag.